Speaking of bears, I have two more. <laughs> hey guys, it's me Angel from Making Baby Taylor and this is my husband Justin from our family vlog, It's the Taylor Crew. Recently I was in San Diego visiting family and I stumbled upon this Japanese store that was full of nothing but items imported from Japan. Since Justin loves Japan, Domo and anime, I decided that it would, might be fun to buy some snacks and candies from that store so that we could taste test them once we were together again in Rhode Island. So, hence this video. We're going to go ahead and try some of these delicious Japanese snacks, so definitely stay tuned. First, we're going to start with this Little Koalas March, because I know you said you've had them before. I, they were popular in the States like 15 years ago. I don't know. Apparently this is a Japanese thing. Like little, maybe, I guess that's where it doesn't look anything like what we had here in the States, man. I don't know. It was in the store. I'm going to try it. I don't know. They're vanilla cream filled, which sounds really tasty. They got this box and then they package it in. Redundancy. <laughs> Or just drop it, that's cool too. It's <laughs> a little tiny koala, very cute. Oh yeah, pan. I just dropped mine too. That's me too for the bear. About your life. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's it. It's pretty tasty. That's really good though. So would you say that's a thumbs up? I like it. Thumbs up. Next along the cookie line, we're gonna try these little, they're called baby ball cookies. The kids oh, really like these. The kids yeah. tried these. I wonder why. Alright. Yeah. Hmm. They, uh... That didn't taste like I expected. No, it's, it's kind of plain. Uh, and really, or, like, like a chalky texture. It's fairly dry. Yeah. Um, that's a thumbs down for me. The, the kids can have them. <laughs> and Pocky! Dude, Pocky. <laughs> we right. love Pocky. We've tried the regular Pocky and the strawberry Pocky, right? Strawberry. And, yeah. and strawberry um, like a regular. Um, the, well, this is Cookies and Cream. I've never seen this, so I was excited to grab this because I had a feeling that he would like it. He likes Cookies and Cream. He likes Pocky. Put the two together. No, it's not intentions. It changes a refund. <laughs> Okay, there it is. I was waiting for that to, to kick in. I think I like it. I think it might be my favorite Pocky. Thumbs up. How dare you? It's all about in the original name game, baby. There's also this Hello Kitty strawberry like Pocky like thing. I thought it was really cool. It's got all the Japanese characters on the back, which was neat. It's like a like it's like a comic strip on the back. Yeah, it's like our bazooka Joe. Like even the ingredients, like everything's in Japanese, which is pretty cool. Oh my goodness! Even the little wrapper inside has Hello Kitty on it. That's cute. And what are these little prints on here? Uh huh. Wow. Hmm. It's just strawberry pocky. Oh, I could. It's strawberry pocky with Hello Kitty on it. Branding. Branding. Right, here's yet another Hello Kitty product. It's a flavored marshmallow. They had a few different flavors. This is pineapple. So These are got, just marshmallows. It's a marshmallow with pineapple jelly inside. It's like squishy. I know. Like okay. Hmm. And outside tastes like a little bit of pineapple too. And then bite into it. Ooh. That just catches you off guard. <laughs> no. I get some marshmallow and there's stuff. Stuff inside. Yeah, I've never had a marshmallow like that in my life. Mm -mm. Um 
I don't know. I for me, it's neither thumbs up nor thumbs down. I don't hate them, but I don't. Yeah, just yeah. a little sweet and like just different. <laughs> not gross, but just not totally delicious either. Okay. I have a feeling the kids will love them though. Yeah, I like those awful cracker cookies. So now we're gonna start in on some candy. So we're gonna start with the world's most popular flavor, the green tea. Kit Kat. How is that the world's most popular flavor? I don't know. They had a sign there that said it's the worldwide highest selling flavor of Kit Kat. Like a Wait, what does this say? It has a label on it that says, Whoa. this product is not a product authorized by the United States trademark owner for importation and is physically and materially different from the authorized product. That's right, because- I guess Nestle did not want this in the United States. Nope. <laughs> You ever seen anything other than a chocolate or a white chocolate Kit Kat bar? Not in America. Uh, not in America. It so you got our little individual package. 66 K Cal. Nice. Yeah, and it's got a little. 3%. It's like a little 3% of like, I'm assuming that's your like daily value. Like just know. this little thing is 3%. You got a little, little QR code on the back. Yeah, no. thumbs up, dude. That's awesome. Green Kit Kat. Nope. Maybe that's what algae tastes like. <laughs> Thumbs down. You know, uh, I like green tea, other things. Yeah. Like, yeah, green tea frappuccino, green tea, like actual green tea. Do not like, do not like that. That's, uh, mm, that's not what I want my Kit Kats to taste like. You can have the ginger ice cream. I did, I, yeah, well that's not green tea. Well, no, but just like. But I liked the ginger ice cream well, the other day. We went to a Japanese restaurant for my birthday, and that was good. But yeah. this green tea Kit Kat, I do not like. I do not like it to taste like that. Nope. So uh, I'm assuming that's why they had that sticker. <laughs> like by They're the like, way. They're <laughs> like, Nestle's like, please, Americans don't judge other brand from this. Mmm. Okay. Now I got this little bag of bulk candy. They had all kinds of different little candies. So let's see. Start with this one. It's a little guy, and it looks like a little donut. Mmm, donut. <laughs> Here, I'll take a bite. You take a bite. Was. Oh. It's like the weirdest tasting candy covered pretzel. Yeah, it's kind of like a cookie pretzel -y kind of thing that it's covered in, it seems like strawberry and chocolate. Yeah, yeah. But it's, it's growing on me. Like the first bite of was kind of gross, but now it tastes kind of good, the aftertaste. It's there. So I, yeah, neither. Next is this little guy. That looks like a creamer. <laughs> put in for coffee. Right? And I'm lost. And it's kind of like a little Reese's cup. <laughs> yeah, but the top makes it look like something else entirely. It was all powdery. I thought it was something else. Is that peanut butter? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was really dry, like it had to like rehydrate. Yeah, like imagine a Reese's peanut butter cup that is like really dried out. That's kind of what it tastes like. That's pretty good though, I'm not gonna lie. It had almost like a coffee-ish flavor to it too. Yeah, I wanted to say hazelnut, but I wasn't sure. I, saw, I wish I could remember what, I mean they were labeled in English like in the store, but uh, I don't remember, <laughs> obviously. Nice. There's this little thing. Okay. Um. <laughs> Looks like a really weird place. What the fool? They're yeah, like these little balls. <laughs> oh, jeez. 
Oh. Yeah. Really coffee. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh, that's, that's coffee. Shoot, that was probably a mistake because it's almost bedtime. <laughs> Heck yeah. All right. Mm. It's like really strongly flavored. Oh yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. A little bit of this. Mm. Yeah, no. I mean, I like drinking coffee, but I, I don't like coffee to taste like coffee. Well, he does, so there you go. That's why it's a split vote. Coffee drinkers of the world unite. <laughs> oh, there's this. They, they look kind of like uh, coated jelly beans. Yeah, I, I don't I'm know. kind of scared. Is that sugar? Does this look like sugar? Mm -hmm. um, I really don't like the texture of this. No. Uh-uh. That's... It's not even chalky. It's like, uh... I don't know how to describe it. Nope. Nope. You know, chalky is kind of the closest I can get to it, but like, like a... It's, it's almost like really fine mashed potatoes. Yes! Like a tad lumpy. But a little bit, like, I mean, it's got a little bit of chewiness to it because it is technically like a gelatin. Type, yeah, some lumps in there. But it's but like, like grainy. Yeah. Yeah, like a grainy jelly bean. And it did not have much flavor to it. It's just oh. gross texture. No. Thumbs down. Bump that. This guy looks like a smaller version of that to. Whoops. All right, look, you, you get that one because that one is like so ridiculously small. Because, like, this is my pinky for scale. Okay, oh it's yeah. It's like pinky for scale, dude. These are really small, small, so we're gonna... This one's like a little cake or something? They're, I think they're just meant to be cute. Yeah, yeah like, his looks like a little cheesecake or something. I got this, like, I got this little cake here. Mine's like a souffle. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like that. There's some... Um, Really creamy. It's basically like that other one, but without being real dry. It's just creamy. Without the pretzel thingy in it? No, this, the this one. Oh. The one that was like the peanut butter cup, but like drier. Yeah. And a little bit hot hazel nutty coffee kind of flavor. It's exactly the same flavor, but it's like a really creamy chocolate. So it's really good. I really liked mine. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. How was yours? Yeah, it was good. Is it like some sort of a cake like it has strawberry on it like so it, oh. it had the flavor of the little i think it wanted to be a chocolate cake i think it really wanted to be a chocolate cake really bad here's this little like jelly candy uh yep mine's a, a jelly bear looks like pedo bear i mean <laughs> i mean this is a family channel i mean it's a family channel <laughs> uh oh god <laughs> It's like literally like the <laughs> consistency of a jello shot. I mean, what? <laughs> this is a family channel. <laughs> mine won't even come out of the wrapper. It's like wet. My hand is like damp. <laughs> I'm serious, mine won't even come out of the wrapper. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm about ready to give up on this. Look at this. I can't. Yeah. Seriously? All right, gotta hold it together. All right, yeah, see this, see this bear? <laughs> to my fingers. Yeah, yours is all sticky and mine's all wet. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's not a whole lot of flavor to mine. It, it's very much the consistency of, of Jello, um, but not, I mean, I, neither good nor bad. It just was. How about yours? Mine tastes like a, like flower tea. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Speaking of those bear candies, I have two more. So here's a bag. Here's, here's the front. So there's two different flavors. I'm gonna go with the purple. You would. Thanks for the green one. It's probably gonna be green tea flavor. <laughs> I didn't buy anything that sounded totally disgusting. Except for green tea Kit Kat. Well, I heard people say they liked them. I thought that we would like them. Okay. Oh yeah, this is really sticky. Dang. This is like a really firm jelly. Yeah. Woo. I can't tell by smelling it. Mmm. Mine's great. 
Yo. This tastes like that aloe vera water. Mmm. Aloe water. He likes that stuff. Represent. I liked mine. It was like jelly. It was, or it was, or it was like grape, like grape jelly, but firm. And if you like aloe water, mine was good. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Here's this little banana. <laughs> Check it the banana. And it's got a little monkey on the label. Let's see. I think it's totally share this. We're gonna share the banana. We're gonna share the banana. Okay. Good to go. Oh. There's a banana. Mm-hmm. Looks like a but chocolate banana. What chocolate, like really, like creamy chocolate kind of consistency, with like, a banana flavor. Like the uh, Disneyland frozen bananas, chocolate covered bananas. I don't know. Yeah. Like the the banana like flavor to this though is a little odd, so I, I don't really like it that much. I don't like it. Look, another Hello Kitty. This one is a chocolate marshmallow. Oh, man. All right, Hello Kitty and the marshmallow. Does it have stuff in it? Oh, yeah, stuff in it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I actually like this one a I lot. Because the middle is kind of like chocolate frosting. Yeah. Like the consistency and flavor of chocolate frosting, and that was good. Marshmallow and chocolate go together. Um, yeah, that was really good. Tropical pineapple. Not so much. Yeah. So this, they have these, it said milk on it. They ha also had like strawberry and chocolate, but I just got the regular. So it's the little balls like before. Hmm. They have kind of that like candy coating crunchiness that like Sixlets have, but just on a smaller scale. Oh yeah, Sixlets. And yeah, it's just kind of like, like a milky vanilla. Not bad. Yeah, it's just like a little flavoring. Like yeah. not, there's not it's a It's not lot real of... overpowering. It's, mm -mm. it's not like super delicious, but it's not gross at all. We got these little jelly gummy thingies. It looks like green apple and I don't know, some kind of berry. Do you want to try the purple one this time? Oh, well, I thought you were going to forget. Well, this one's like the wet, this is the wet jello, like before, like the pink one. Oh. That's so wet. Whoa! Mm -hmm. Dang! It's like literally dripping off my finger. Yeah. Oh, wow. But it tastes like green apple. It's pretty so, good. So this is like jelly. I'm not too crazy about the texture, but the, the flavor is pretty good. Yeah. So, like... I feel like if you're going to make a candy-flavored oyster... <laughs> <laughs> That's where you would start with, man. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why I don't like the texture. So got these two guys, they're super lemon and super soda. I'm gonna give you a soda because I like sour and you don't, so. Yeah. You you keep your sour patches. I love sour candy. Who's with me? Tell me in the comments. Oh. Woo! Oh my god. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh. This what? Is really sour. For the love of goodness. <laughs> um. Oh wait. Oh. It's, it's, okay. It's a little bit chewy. I feel I'm like getting, I'm getting to like tasting of candy. Mm -hmm. Not whatever that was. That's basically like a lemon head, like, but super sour like a warhead. Yeah, I, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Last but not least, I have these two little guys. Which one do you want to do? I don't know, you, you let me know. I knew you was going to do that. Right, I so. like the cute guy. I uh, thought so. So this is Kasuga, Kasuge? Oh, look. It's a little guy. 
You don't like it? Like a cinnamon flavored cough drop. Oh, that sounds gross. Mine is a slightly sour peach candy. Okay. So I like mine. Mine's good. Yeah, whatever that was. <laughs> I don't even know. All right, so you have it. We tried all those fun Japanese candies and snacks. For the most part, they were pretty delicious. I'm pretty pleased about you. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm getting that. Thanks to somebody else's sweets. So I hope you enjoyed it. Please thumbs up if you did. If you want to see more about this Japanese store, be sure to head over to our family vlog. It's the Taylor Crew and subscribe so you don't miss that video when I get to getting that up on the channel. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.